Good afternoon. All right, moon is exactly with Pluto, and it is about four hours away from, well, about six to eight hours away from the exact new moon. But for now, we have these few hours of the most tense and intense inner tension being caused with moon conjunct Pluto. So social circles are feeling sort of dead, the vibe out is feeling too intense to be interacting with other people. I know I just had a little upsetting moment with my daughter and then I left to be alone away and she left to be alone in this exact moon conjunct Pluto. But as we start to come out of that and the moon hits Aquarius, it is more of a social sign. When the moon comes from Capricorn to Aquarius, it is still the cold hard winter. It's the middle of winter Aquarius. But it's past the CEO lessons, you know, it's past being the boss. And it's moving on to working with the community. How can you take those high level Capricorn uh, cardinal expertise that you have and mingle them within the community to help people? How can you use that corporation? You know, I want to say corporation for Capricorn all the time because it is the corpse. It is the dead, cold, hard winter and the all caps name. The word for Capricorn is use. Usury is their word. They are Saturn. It is Saturn written all over Capricorn. And indeed the ruler of Aquarius in old astrology, and I still use it, is Saturn. I don't give Uranus the main rulership of Aquarius. It's just a co-ruler. It's a modern astrology thing to bring Aquarius, in, to bring Uranus in the ruler of Aquarius. So keep in mind Saturn. Look how much Saturn we have. Mercury, Moon, Pluto, Sun, Venus, and Saturn are all in Saturn-ruled signs. What is Saturn? It is the dead, cold, serious winter when everybody has gone so inner um, that they are working on their own expertise. So how are you your own boss? How do you use that energy within yourself, this Saturn rulership uh, luminary energy. How do you use that within yourself? I'm sure most people aren't used to being their own boss, their own leader. They look to others and that is because we've been programmed with that our whole lives. We were sent to school, public school. We spent 12 years or more there learning that we don't know it all. We need to look to someone else. And that's sort of exactly what I'm talking about. Are you the teacher in that classroom or are you the student or can you recognize that you're actually both? You are sometimes going to be the teacher and you are sometimes going to be the student. That is really coming down from the leadership leadership sign of Capricorn into the community with Aquarius. So how are we working together? Groups are coming out more, communities are opening up more, and the ability to co-work with other people who have an expertise in something that you don't are really opening up right now. Forming whole new alliances with other experts and things. Forming whole communities and social networks. You should be seeing that in major ways all over your life, whether it's new groups starting for exercise or new groups starting for book groups or learning groups, whatever it is, you should be seeing an influx of that right now for the new moon and in this month of Aquarius overall. Since that's what Aquarius rules, you will see it in Aquarius people that you meet. They are very social. They're social butterflies. They're an air sign. They're always trying to talk to everyone and get a little bit of information from everyone and get to know everyone a little bit. But, but from many, many years of personal experience and also having Mars Aquarius myself, I do realize that Aquarius is not really a sign that is one of the community you know they have a goal and they always have an expertise a Saturnian side to them where there's something they're trying to share with that community you know think whatever it is they're selling whether it, even if they're not selling it if they're just trying to get their point across Aquarius still has Saturn is my point they're not just this open and friendly and they're trying to just make friends they usually have a goal a goal for their own means to make something of themselves with that community in that community they're usually good at pointing out what everyone else is good at Aquarius 
because they do get to know everyone so well when they're down there in the community. As for the aspects, well, let's get into that more later. I just wanted to say happy new moon, and we'll deal with all of this Capricorn and Aquarius right up front, since that's what this whole month is going to be about more, is Saturn. Working in the community, working with coworkers, starting new groups, working within groups you've already been in, and working with other experts, people that are on the same level as you with something. That will be expert level to some, but, you know, beginner level for others, and that's fine. Everyone has a different gift. Everyone is working on different things in their lives right now. So get in where you fit in and work with each other this month. 